नमस्सर्वेभ्य स्वागत कक्षायां प्रार्थनया प्रारंभ कुर गुरब्रह्म गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेशर गुर साक्षात् परम ब्रह्म तस्म श्रीगुरव नम सरस्वती नमस्तुभ्यं वरदे कामिणी विद्यारंभम क्या सिद्धिर्भव मे सदा ओं तत्सत् अद्वादशतम कक्षा अस्त तृतीय पाठे अंतिम भागे स्म त्र सम विषय किंचित अद्य पटा वयम तो संख्या संख्या नामा ज्ञातवंत एक चरी पंच षट सप्त अष्ट नव दश इतिदश द्वादश किम तदपी उक्त समय तो एकदशपर्यत वर्तते त्र पुनः एक उत मैं अस्तु अत्र समय विषय किम उतमस्ती पटा संस्कृत व्यवहार समय अरुण षड्वादने उत्तिष्टति अरुण षड्वादने उत्तिष्टति साक्षात सूर्य यहाँ अरुण सह अभी षड्वादने सामतया उत्तिषति अस्मा उत्था सह अभी उत्तिषति सैत्म कॉपी नर अरुण षड्वादने उत्तिषति अत्र पश्य अरुण उत्तिषति अरुण उत्तिषति तत्र कर्मपदम कि नास्ति उत्थान तो कर्मपदेन साकम न बवति अरुण साक्षात तत्र उत्तिषति तो तरी अत्र किम दत्तमस्ती षड्वादने कालसूचक पदम षड्वादने वादने किम रामे वत् सप्तमी एक वचने अस्ति ओके एट सिक्स ओ क्लाक सो देर इज एक्चुअली ए सेंस ऑफ लोकेशन बट लोकेशन नॉट इन स्पेस बट लोकेशन इन टाइम सो वादने इज सप्तमी एक वचना फॉर्म ओके सो अरुण षड्वादने उत्तिषति षड् सो षट विनो इज सिक्स राइट सो षट प्लस वादनम षड्वादनम दर इज ए साफनिंग ऑफ द टकार हैपनिंग ड्यू टू अटन संधि सो दट वाई इट्स टेकिंग डकार Actually, the vakara is written below the dakara normally, but here due to lack of font, there is a halanta dakara followed by a v and a. Okay, shadvadane uttishtati. Atra to prataha iti na uktamasti. Atra angla bhasha yam gets up at six o'clock in the morning iti uktamasti. Tatra morning iti suchana datum kima pi tatra vakya samskrite nasti. Okay. प्रातः काले षड्वादने उत्तिषति यदि उच्य है तरी साक्षा प्रातः काले अपि स्थापित भवति तदपि सप्तम्याम ओके इन द मॉर्निंग एट सिक्स ओ क्लाक अफकोर्स इन इंग्लिश यू स्विच फ्रॉम इन एंड एट ड्यू टू वेरियस देर ओन ग्रामर कॉम्प्लिकेशन बट फॉर अस् प्रातः काले षड्वादने बोथ अर्स सिंपल अधिकरण सप्तमी कालवाचक ओके सो माता अष्टवादने उपाहारम करोति कर्मपदम अस्ति अत्र करोति इत्यस्य कर्मपदम अस्ति उपाहारम किम करोति उपाहारम करोति का करोति माता करोति कदा करोति कदा वेन कदा करोति अष्टवादने उपाहारम करोति प्राय अत्रापि प्रातः काले अष्टवादने इति स्यात् ओके हम्म पिता सार्ध सप्तवादने आगच्छति पिता सार्ध सप्तवादने आगच्छति ओके अत्र कर्मपदम न सूचितमस्ति भवितुम शक्यते गृहम आगच्छति इति किमपि तत्र न सूचितमस्ति परन्तु कदा इति तु उक्तमस्ति सार्ध सप्तवादने अत्र किम अभवत् प्राक् वयं दृष्टवन्तः षड्वादने सिक्स ओ क्लाक अष्टवादने एट ओ क्लाक चिंता नसी अत्र सार्ध सप्तवादने उतमस्ती कि अधिक सार्ध इति सूचितमस्ति 
सप्त इत्यस्मात् पूर्वमेव सार्ध इति स्थापित अस्ति तो अत्र सार्ध इत्यस्मिन् भागद्वयम अस्ति स अधिकम अर्ध इति स प्लस अर्ध इति अस्ति तत्र स अर्ध तो स इत्युक्ते विथ ओके अर्ध इत्युक्ते हाफ सो विथ हाफ सेवन एट द टाइम ओके सो विथ हाफ सेवन इज द टेक्निक ऑफ सेइंग हाफ पास्ट सेवन ओके हाफ पास्ट सेवन लाइक वी डू द सेम टेक्निक इन इंग्लिश विद द पास्ट राइट हाफ पास्ट सो हियर सार्ध सप्तवादने ओके सो इट इज एन एडिशन दिस स इज इंडिकेटिंग एडिशन ऑफ अ हाफ टू द सेवन सो सेवन एंड अ हाफ और सेवन सेवन आवर्स एंड थर्टी मिनिट्स ओके सो पिता सप सार्ध सप्तवादने आगच्छति सो ही कम्स एट सेवन थर्टी हियर दे हैव यूज्ड प्रेजेंट टेंस परहैप्स इफ इट वाज बिफोर सेवन थर्टी टेक्निकली वी शुड यूज आगमिष्यति आगमिष्यति टू यूज भविष्यत काला बट फॉर इमीडिएट नीड्स दिस इज ओके शुड नॉट पिक स्वर्णा पादोन दशवादने निद्राति दशवादने वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड एट टेन ओ क्लॉक निद्राति शी स्लीप्स अगेन अकर्मक ओके नो कर्म पद पॉसिबल फॉर निद्रा जस्ट लाइक स्था धातु और उत्तिष्ठति कैनट है सिमिलर निद्राति कैनट है सो स्वर्ण पादोन दशवादने सो पाद प्लस ऊन प्लस दशवादने पाद इज ए क्वार्टर ओके चतुष पद किल सामान्यतया अस्माकमपि हस्तद्वयम पादद्वयम तु तर्हि पादम इत्यनेन वन क्वार्टर उच्यते ओके 15 मिनिट ब्लॉक इज कॉल्ड पाद ओके दैट्स व्हाई इवन श्लोक विषय चतुष्पदी बेस्ड ऑफ फोर पाद सर्देन इन श्लोक राइट सो दैट वे सो पाद ऊन व्हाट इज ऊन ऊन मींस लेस एंड लेस by less by okay una okay so reduced that sense is there in una so pada una dashavadanam sandhi it becomes padona padona means less by 15 minutes 10 o'clock so what it will turn out to be because there is a subtraction with the una it will turn out to be 9:45 so quarter to 10 so the sense of english quarter to 10 okay सो पादो न दशवादन ओके निद्राति स्वर्ण समर्ल श्विवादने आचार्य बोधय सो हियर दे हैव यूज ए फ्यूचर टेन्स नथिंग अदर इज न्यू देर श्व बिकॉज दे यूज श्व दे यूज फ्यूचर टेन्स बोधय सो टुमारो ओके श्व आटोमैटिकली श्व इज ए सप्त सप्तम्यर्तक पद श्व ओके It is like an avyaya fixed in uh, saptam yarta. So tomorrow means at tomorrow, in tomorrow, whatever is the English grammar for that. Okay, dvivadane at two o'clock. Acharya, the teacher, bodhi shyati will teach. Okay, praparashwa ha bhano vasara ha asti. now after introducing a few few things with time element exactly using hour quote and minute quote or actually quadrant quotes they have added some new references about time how to say tomorrow how to say day after tomorrow that's what they are using in this example so praparashwah bhanuvasarah asti to praparashwarah day after tomorrow it actually day, day after day after tomorrow see parash they, they they jumped the gun a little bit shwah is tomorrow parashwah is day after tomorrow praparashwah is day after day after tomorrow okay there isn't any precise word in english for that so we have to construct this way day after day after day after tomorrow i don't know they said three times i think i think uh, i think uh, this is a little bit uh, incorrect here in english so it is just uh, two days from now okay tomorrow is shwah parashwah is day after tomorrow praparashwah is day after day after tomorrow only two times day after should come not three times so we should correct that let me do that
just as a reminder for me in the future to point out that one extra is there. Okay. Hyaha Vadi Rajaha Gita Vaan. Hyaha. So this is yesterday. Adhya is today actually. Adhya, which is there in the next sentence. Adhya Hyaha. Hyaha. Not haha, not yaha. Hyaha. H y aha. H y aha. Hyaha. Little bit twister, but you should practice that. Hyaha. Vadi Raja Gita Vaan. Yesterday, okay, Vadi Raja, a fellow by the name Vadi Raja, he sang. This is a past tense participle form. Gita Vaan. Agayat would be the Langlakara form using the Gita to, but here it is in participle form. We are going to learn that also going forward. Okay. Became the fellow who sang. That sense is there in Gita Vaan. Okay, it's masculine. So, Hyaha Vadi Raja Gita Vaan. So, in simple translation, yesterday Vadi Raja sang. Okay, Adhya Griha Pravesha Karyakramaha Asti. Adhya, today. Okay, different from Idanim. Idanim is now. Okay, Adhya is today. This day, today. Okay. Adhya Griha Pravesha Karyakramaha. All of us know this. Grihasya Praveshaha Griha Praveshaha Griha Griha Pravesha Iti Karyakramaha. Something like that. Okay. Um, uh, so house entry function. No, new new house entry function. Asti is there. So they called it Griha Pravesha only in English. Yeah? Because it's not exactly house warming, you can call it that. Okay. Idanim kaha samayaha. See the difference between adhya and idanim. So idanim now immediately gives the sense of time actually, not necessarily just the whole day. Okay. So idanim kaha samayaha. What is the time now? So kaha samayaha being pulling. So kaha is used instead of kim or ka. So kaha samayaha. Idanim kaha samayaha. What's the time now? Okay. Idanim Trivadanam. That is kind of an answer to that. Now it is three o'clock without specifying afternoon, morning. Something is being said most likely afternoon, right? Because that would be daytime. In the sentences above, words that convey time are used both in precise hours and minutes and also in terms of days. Okay. Relative to today. You will now learn the usage of these words. To indicate time, the word vadanam is used. See, in the answer you see vadanam statement. Wherever there was a description of some action, then saptami was used vadane at that time, at that time, like that. Okay? Vadanam. Napumsakalinga shabda, vadanam. So what does vadanam mean? Vadanam means to strike. Okay? So it comes from vadudatu only. Vadati, that one only. Okay. So, Vadanam to make something tell, basically to strike the bell. Okay. So, uh, the same strike sense carries over in English. Okay. The clock strikes three, like that we say na, in nursery rhymes. So, that's one Vadanam. Okay. Observe the following examples. Okay. So, five and twelve is the big needle. So, five o'clock. So, Pancha Vadanam. Sap Vadanam, Dasha Vadanam. I don't know. This is a little bit for children. They have put it, uh, but it's nice for us to just take a quick look at it. So, what is this boy showing? Nava Vadanam. He is showing Nava Vadanam. Okay. The pictures above show five o'clock, seven o'clock, and ten o'clock. Try to say the time from five to twelve o'clock in the same manner. Okay. So. Um, uh, basically, Panchavadanam, Shadvadanam, Saptavadanam, Ashtavadanam, Navavadanam, Dashavadanam, Ekadashavadanam, Dvadashavadanam. Like that it goes. Okay. We have to literally practice it from Eka up to 12 to be precise. Okay. In the examples below, note the slight difference. Okay. Now they have shifted to quarter, half, and quarter less, one less quarter, that portion. Okay. So, this is at 5 or a little past 5 and that is at 3. So it is uh, quarter past 5, right? So, Sapada Panchavadanam. Sapada Panchavadanam. Sapada Panchavadanam. 
fairly straightforward uh, stacking in the sandhi form also okay then this is 5 and 30 minutes so half sa ardha panchavadanam sardha here there is a savarna dirga sandhi sardha panchavadanam sardha panchavadanam okay then one quarter less than six o'clock. So, Pada Una Shet Vadanam becomes Pada Una Shed Vadanam. Ta happens to Da, and then A plus U becomes O is called Gunasandhi. So, the Gunasandhi has happened. Pada Una Shed Vadanam. We'll be learning all these techniques, okay, over time. Okay. Any questions in on this slide? Okay, we'll move forward. Fairly straightforward. So here we have continued uh, summarization and learning of the same. So let us keep reading on. One o'clock, eka vadanam. Two o'clock, dvi vadanam. Three o'clock, tri vadanam. Four o'clock, chatur vadanam. And we have to kind of continue to say pancha vadanam, shad vadanam. That's what was the sentence below. I don't know why it's displaced a little bit prior to this. So, Shadvadanam, Saptavadanam, so on and so forth, up to Ek Dvadasha Vadanam. Okay. Then, quarter is called Sapada, I mean, with a, with a quarter, like that. Half an hour is called Sardha, with a half. Three fourth is Padona, but from the full. Okay. Three fourth is not additive, it is subtractive. So, we should go to the next hour and stack it. Okay because it is subtractive. So, Padona, that is a quarter less than the next hour. The 10.45 is quarter to 11. That's what they are telling us. Therefore, 5.45 is Padona Shat. Padona Shat, quarter to 6. Padona Shat Vadanam, if you want to complete it. They have just shown the prefix part to the Vadanam. Okay, next they are summarizing this relative reference to today, tomorrow, day after, yesterday, day before yesterday. How do we say that? Uh, there are there are enough uh, words in Sanskritam to cover the <laughs> week. Okay, so that is why it's nice to know that we have actually compact words to cover three days back and three days forward. Okay, so that means including today we will cover seven days. So that means we are able to refer to a whole week uh, around our today. Adya today, Adya today. Hmm? Shwaha tomorrow, Shwaha tomorrow. So remember, all these have in a sentence a saptami position. Without any modification, you can use them as if they are locative nouns. Okay. So Shwaha idanim now, idanim now. But this is time. Okay, not a day. Okay, this is time right now. Hyaha, Hyaha yesterday. Okay, Parashwaha, Parashwaha, day after tomorrow. There is a little bit of random order. It's okay, we will practice it in order later. Okay, then Praparashwaha, day after, day after tomorrow. See here they state it correctly. So two days from now. Parahyaha, two days, uh, day before yesterday. Hyaha, Parahyaha, just like Parashwaha was there, Parahyaha, day before yesterday. Okay. Then praparahyaha, day before, day before yesterday. Okay. It's all right. So agami, the coming. Okay. Agami shanivasare aham nidram karomi. Agami guru vasare aham devalayam gamishyami. Something like that. Use agami, the coming. So agami samdine, something you have to say. Hmm? So gata is the other variant used for Previous sir, Gata Shukravasare Lakshmi Puja Asit, something like that. Gata Shukravasare. So you have to uh, kind of, uh, you normally we attach it to the, uh, attach it to the word uh, that follows. So Gata Shukravasare, we write it together. I think it can be used separately. Agami for sure can be used separately. Gata also perhaps because these are like avyayas. So they are actually word in their full right. But you can stack them with the next word using the attachment method. Gata Shukravasare together as Gata Shukravasare, Agami Shanivasare like that. Okay. Saptaha. Okay. So this one is a declinable noun. Okay. It's no more a indeclinable. So Saptahe, Saptahasya, 
सप्ताहम एवरीथिंग इज पॉसिबल बट इट्स ए पुल्लिंग शब्द सप्ताह सप्ताह ओके सो वीक ओके पक्ष फोर्ट नाइट ओके फिफ्टीन डेज Krishna Paksha, Shukla Paksha. We know that, no? The moon's phases, right? Moving towards darkness and moving towards full brightness. So, Krishna Paksha is when he moves towards darkness. Shukla Paksha is when he becomes brighter and brighter every day. Okay, Masa ha, month, Masa ha, month. So, this Saptaha ha, Paksha ha, Masa ha. These are all declinable words. They are clearly in Pullinga, as far as I can identify. to be cautious with uh, that sometimes some sakaranta shabdas can be in napumsaka but i think it's a run pulling okay uh, varsham see napumsaka shabda varsham varshaha is also there but varshaha in pullinga is used to refer to rain okay varsham in napumsaka is used to refer to year there is a there is a relationship between them because uh, rain is annual there is a relationship so the the name for the year varsham is derived from the seasonality of the rains which is annual okay so because the original dhatu is rain varshayati it rains okay the dhatu is from rain so the usage as a year is a derivative okay somebody has Mahade. the hand up yes mohde yes, uh, yeah. my query is mohde that uh, how do you, uh, Uh, how do i determine when to put the uh, uh, anuswara uh, or not like in gatha there is no anuswar but ah, the that's rest that's how you have to are. that's how you have to remember it is over time okay. you will pick that it won't be gataha gataha means some masculine fellow who had gone that is the sense of gataha okay Jeez. later Jeez. on you will find gataha is also there and that gataha is a declinable uh, um uh, derivative krudanta derivative participle derivative of the noun of the kriya dhatu gam okay going so the fellow who went is called gataha gata is the lady who went gatam is the thing that went but gata just in the way it is is used as a uh, previous uh, previous no it's just used to mean oh, previous okay mane previous day or uh, gata dine gata banu asare like that gata samayeshu something like that you can use it with many other uh, aspects okay but it is clearly something about time something that is gone okay that about <coughs> most like a prefix there okay so so yeah varsham we saw that the other name so, so sir the uh, uh, anuswar uh, i mean the visarga like aha uh-huh. we will have to get the feel of it by practice hmm yeah, there is no that, magic that we have to we have to build the vocabulary over time yes correct okay sir thank you uh, it's okay um, uh, every uh, as long as you keep engaged with sanskritam and keep doing studies uh, every week you will be gaining uh, a repertoire of uh, words and you'll be cleaning up any mistakes you make over time samvatsaraha vatsaraha okay so this uh, is another name for year samvatsaraha vatsaraha two variants are there but samvatsara is the more common one as we know samvatsaraha okay i don't know how this is derived sarati means that which moves samvat samvat is also used in the sense of a annual thing we can we say you know vikrama samvat like that vikrama so, samvat hmm so some derivative will be there we'll not worry about it hmm okay so what i have done in the color uh, thing above is go in the correct order so adhya is written in the middle so adhya hya the way to practice is like this adhya hya parahya praparahya and then start again adya shwah parashwah praparashwah you very easy to remember so there is only hya and shwah to remember and go with para and prapara okay as we move further and further away very straight forward okay so adya shani vasarah shwah bhanu vasarah parashwah somavasarah praparashwah mangala vasarah 
ಅದ್ಯ ಶನಿವಾಸರ ಹ್ಯ ಶುಕ್ರವಾಸರ ಪರಹ್ಯ ಗುರುವಾಸರ ಪ್ರಪರ ಹ್ಯ ಮಂಗಲ ಬುಧವಾಸರ ಸಾರಿ ಬುಧವಾಸರ ಸೊ ಪರ ಪ್ರಪರಶ್ವರ ಮಂಗಲ ಸೊ ಪ್ರಪರ ಹ್ಯ ಇಸ್ ಬುಧ ಸೊ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಕವರಿಂಗ್ ಎ ಫುಲ್ ವೀಕ್ ದೇ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಹೌ ವಿ ಗೋ ದೆನ್ ಬಿಲೋ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದ ಅದರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ದಿನ ಸಪ್ತಾಹ ಪಕ್ಷ ಮಾಸ ಋತು ಸಂವತ್ಸರ ದಶಕ ವಾಟ್ ಆರ್ ದೀಸ್ ದಿನ ಒನ್ ಡೇ ಸಪ್ತಾಹ ಒನ್ ವೀಕ್ ಓಕೆ ಪಕ್ಷ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಡೇಸ್ ಹಾಫ್ ದ ಮೂನ್ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಮಾಸ ಫುಲ್ ಮೂನ್ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಆರ್ ಫುಲ್ ಸೋಲಾರ್ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಡಿಪೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ಹೌ ಯು ಡೂ ದ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವೇಶನ್ ಓಕೆ ದೆನ್ ಋತು ಇಸ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಎ ಟೂ ಮಂತ್ ಪೀರಿಯಡ್ ಮಾಸದ್ವಯಂ ಋತು ಬವತಿ ಓಕೆ ಋತು ದೆನ್ ಸಂವತ್ಸರ ಸೊ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಋತು ಮೇಕೆ ಸಂವತ್ಸರ ಆರ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಮಾಸ ಮೇಕೆ ಸಂವತ್ಸರ ಸಂವತ್ಸರ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ ಮೇಕೆ ದಶಕ ಗೋ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಶತಕಂ ದಿಸ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ವೇರಿಯೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಅದೇ ಐ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಟೆಟ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ವೆದರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಶಕಂ ಆರ್ ದಶಕ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಚೆಕ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟು ಕಾನ್ಫಿಡೆಂಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಹವ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ದೇರ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಸಿ ಇಟ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಶಕಂ ರಾಧರ್ ದನ್ ದಶಕ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಚೆಕ್ I mean, I mean in Pratama Vibhakti, whether it's Pullinga or Napumsaka Linga. In Dhritiya, it will be Dashakam in both cases, but that's different. Okay. Mm. We'll move forward. Okay, and we'll do some abhyasa of what we learned. Okay, we learned about time. So, let us do some abhyasa. Very easy. Okay. So, uh, let me invite Rupa S. What is it? Rupa S. can you unmute yourself i hope you joined us early enough okay i think rupa varya is unable to unmute so let's call upon pavan kumar varya pavan kumar varya mahodaya ha mahodaya so you have to help us with this first question yes. just to tell us in orally of course you can't write on the screen i will be opening up the thing so 3.15 3.15 how do you say that in samskritam ಸಪಾದ ತ್ರಿವಾದನ ಸಪಾದ ತ್ರಿವಾದನ ವೆಲ್ ಡನ್ ಸಪಾದ ತ್ರಿವಾದನ ಸೊ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ರೈಟ್ ಇನ್ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ಲಿಪಿ ದ ನಂಬರ್ಸ್ ನ್ಯೂಮರಲ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಗೆಟ್ ಫೆಮಿಲಿಯರ್ ವಿತ್ ದಟ್ ಸೊ ಆಲ್ ದ ಹಿಂದಿ ಉತ್ತ ಮರಾಠಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ನೋ ದಿಸ್ ವೆರಿ ವೆಲ್ ಬಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಕನ್ನಡಿಗ ತಮಿಳಿಯನ್ಸ್ ತೆಲುಗು ಪೀಪಲ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಮಲಯಾಳೀಸ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಲರ್ನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಫ್ ಫ್ರೆಶ್ ಸೊ ತ್ರೀ ಡಾಟ್ ಒನ್ ಫೈವ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ದಟ್ ದೋ ಇಟ್ ಲುಕ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಫೋರ್ ಇನ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ಓಕೆ all right so 3.15 then 445 mahodaya padona panchavadanam correct padona panchavadanam mahodaya went to the next hour because of the reduction so padona panchavadanam 4.4.4.45 padona panchavadanam see 4 looks like that okay then 1145 mahodaya padona ದ್ವಾದಶವಾದನಂ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಪಾದೋನ ದ್ವಾದಶವಾದನಂ ಸಿ ಆಸ್ ಒನ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಪಾದೋನ ದ್ವಾದಶವಾದನಂ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಓಕೆ ಅಂಡ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ದಿಸ್ ನೈನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ದೆ ಲುಕ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಮಿರರ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಕರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ನೈನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನೆಗೆಟಿವ್ ಕರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದೆ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಅಂಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಇನ್ ಕನ್ನಡ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ನೈನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಲುಕ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಕಾಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಬಟ್ ಇನ್ 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 in devanagari script 1 and 9 look like mirrors okay somewhat like mirrors if you can call it that okay then 730 sartha saptavadanam sartha saptavadanam well done mahodaya with half 7 o'clock sartha saptavadanam see 7 has this this world and 8 will have like like that 8 also will come somewhere i think not in this list but 8 will be like that okay so 7 is like that so usually it is confusion with between 8 and 7 so 7 will have the whorl and like that 8 will not usually have a whorl will go like that up okay all right then 10:15 sapada dashavadanam sapada dashavadanam correct sapada dashavadanam okay 6:30 sartha shatvadanam 
ಅದ್ಯ ಭಾನುವಾಸರ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಯು ಥಿಂಕ್ ಅದ್ಯ ಭಾನುವಾಸರ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಕದಾ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಐ ನೋ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ಪ್ರನೌನ್ಸ್ ದ ವಿಸರ್ಗ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ವಿ ಇನ್ ಸೌತ್ ನೋ ವಿ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಏರ್ ಇಟ್ ಫುಲ್ಲಿ ವಿತ್ ಎ ಸ್ವರ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ದ ಹ so swa swaha we say swa swa is very difficult to hear by the other party especially over this poor microphone channels okay so soma vasaraha swaha you can put in any order okay so adya banu vasaraha asti so what is missing in this sentence is there is a kriya pada missing so adya banu vasaraha asti swaha soma vasaraha bhavishyati okay bhavishyati we have to use you cannot say asti okay because it is shwaha so bhavishyati we have to go ha budhavasara kada bagini uh, budhavasara pa, parashwaha budhavasara hmm. budha budhavasara bhavishyati well done bhavishyati. okay parashwaha budhavasara bhavishyati is she correct ಭಗಿನಿ ಮಿಸ್ ದ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ದಟ್ ಬುಧವಾಸರ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ಕಿಪಿಂಗ್ ಒನ್ ಡೇ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಸಿಕೆಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ವೆಂಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಶ್ವ ಪರಶ್ವಹ ಮಿಸ್ಟೇಕ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಕಮಿಟ್ ಇನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ಸೀರೀಸ್ ಸೊ ಬಿ ಅವೇಕ್ ಬಿ ಅವೇಕ್ ಲುಕ್ ಅಟ್ ದ ವಾಸರ ಚೆಕ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಗೋ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಪ್ರಪರಶ್ವ ಬುಧವಾಸರ ಭವಿಷ್ಯತಿ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಭಗಿನಿ ಯು ಟ್ರೈಡ್ ಎಫ್ ಯು ಅಪ್ರಿಷಿಯೇಟ್ ಗುಡ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಯು ಮೇಡ್ ಎ ಮಿಸ್ಟೇಕ್ ಭಗಿನಿ ಇಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ಸ್ ಅಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ಸ್ ಅಸ್ ಟು ಅವೇಕನ್ ಅವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ದ ಮಿಸ್ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಕೆನ್ ಕಮಿಟ್ ಓಕೆ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಶ್ರೀ ಮೋಯಿ ಸೇನ್ ವರ್ಯೇ ಶ್ರೀ ಮೋಯಿ ಸೇನ್ ಶಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಅ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಶಿ ವಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ಟು ಪಾರ್ಟಿಸಿಪೇಟ್ ಶನಿವಾಸರ ಶನಿವಾಸರ ವೆರಿ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಅಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ವುಡ್ ಬಿ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯಾ ಪದ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಲರ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಬಿಯಾಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಗಿವನ್ ದೇರ್ ಸೊ ಹ್ಯ ಶನಿವಾಸರ ಆಸೀತ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಲಂಗ್ so uh, asti is lat lakara bhavishyati is lring lakara and rutta lring anyway let me check that later asit is lang lakara past tense yes, yes. okay hmm. i i am aware of this word but i could not ha ah, no problem bagini just we keep challenging so that we keep improving ourselves now uh, continue so, shukravasarah kada shukravasarah shukravasarah parash 
शुक्रवासर आसीत वेलडन पर शुक्रवासर आसीत मंगलवासर कदा अरे बाबा मंगलवा मंगलवा शुक्र नो विल ओनली बी गुरु या या दैट इज व्हाट सो विल इट बी इन द भविष्य फ्रॉम भानुवासर भानुवासर इट विल बी परश्व करेक्ट सोम मंगल सो परश्व वेल डन परश्व मंगलवासर भविष्यंगोली स्क्रिप्ट देर इज पोर्शु आई मीन मैडम श्रीमोई वुड बी श्रीमंती वुड बी कन्वर्सेंट विद वी कॉल लाइक पोर्शु Uh, yes, uh, uh, Parashwa. That is Parashu. And Idanim is also very common in Bengali uh, conversation. Uh, yes. so, so that means you have pretty much uh, using the Sanskrit version with a little modification. Lot of words. Yes, lot of words. Lot of words. Nimesh. Nimesh. Nimesh means a minute. Nimesh. Mm. Nimesh. Mm. Sheshe. So mm. all those are derived from I think uh, this mm. Sanskrit. Very good. In in South we we use Nimisha very much of course. Nimisha. But mm. we use uh, for for reference to tomorrow etc. We have Dravida variants between the four languages. Mm. We share some common forms. So we say Indu, Nale, Nalidu, Adrache, Nalidu, Nenne, Monne. So nothing like Sanskritam for us because we use our own words for those. But okay. uh, yeah, for Sanskrit sake, we learn these forms. We don't. Some things we use more Sanskrit in our language than North. But some places in North, I find you use Sanskrit and where we don't. Very good. Mm. So one thing I want to ask: mm. uh, where you had uh, Sardha Shat Va uh, Sardha Shat Vadanam? Mm. Can I can I? Uh, write it separately the way you have written instead of that can i write shat and vadanam no no you cannot because the shat and vadanam has to go to a compulsory sandhi because it's a samasa pada okay so how do i pronounce so shad vadanam dakara has to come shad vadanam okay uh, I, it's here you say sardha shad vadanam d v a dva shatvadanam uh, hmm? like here but here they have halanta dakara instead of the compounded uh, samyukta akshara okay yeah. you cannot write sardha shat vadanam uh, because then the takara is illegal there because once it has gone into a association with vakara uh, it has a compulsory sandhi because there is a samasta pada it cannot be split with a space There is no Sardha Shet space Vadanam allowed, okay? Because Sardha Shet is not a complete word; it is a pratipadika, okay? It is a stem, noun stem. So since it's a stem, it cannot live alone. It doesn't have a life of its own. Life comes with a pratyaya, okay? In case of samasta pada, the pratyaya is for the whole samasta pada. So it has to attach itself to the next pratipadika, which in turn has the pratyaya, am pratyaya. Hmm? Of the Napumsaka Linga Pratama Vibhakti. Okay, all right. So here, what do I have in yellow? Kaku hu swarito charanam cha. So I just a highlight. Okay. So uh, what is the um, uh, stress will kind of give the importance to how we answer? Shwaha kahavasara ha. Shwaha kahavasara ha. I'm going a little more dramatic, guys. Okay, <laughs> don't laugh. Shwaha kahavasara ha. Shwaha soma vasara ha. Shwaha soma vasara ha. So the accent is on kahavasara ha, soma vasara ha. Okay. Then kada soma vasara ha. Kada soma vasara ha. One way of saying or soma vasara ha kada. 
ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಕದಾ ಸಿ ಟೋನಾಲಿಟಿ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಹೈಯರ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಪೋರ್ಷನ್ ಕದಾ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಇಟ್ ಓನ್ ಬಿ ಕದಾ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಲೈಕ್ ನೋ ಬಡಿ ವಿಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜಸ್ ಪುಟ್ ದ ಕಾಕು ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಕದಾ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಶ್ವ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಸ್ಟ್ರೆಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ರಾ ಪಾಸ್ ಶ್ವ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಓಕೆ ಆರ್ ಸೋಮವಾಸರ ಶ್ವ ಲಿಟ್ಟಲ್ ಟೋನಾಲಿಟಿ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಆಕ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಶ್ವ ಆಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಸ್ ದ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಓಕೆ ನಾಟ್ ಓವರ್ ಡೋಸ್ ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ರೈಟ್ ಗೋ ಅಪ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕಮ್ ಡೌನ್ ಸಿ ಶ್ವ ಶ್ವ ಅಪ್ ಡೌನ್ little bit of that uh, vedic swarita udatta all that is there in our normal language we don't notice it okay <clears throat> all right so we come to the last lesson of the lesson 3 subhashitam sushtu bhashitam that which is told right na kaschidapi janati kim kasya shvo bhavishyati ಅತ ಶ್ವಕರ ಶ್ವ ಕರಣೀಯ ಕುರ್ಯಾದ್ಯೈವ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮನ್ ನ ಕಶ್ಚಿದಿ ಜಾತಿ ಕಂ ಕಸ್ಯಶ್ವೋ ಭವಿಷ್ಯ ಅತ ಶ್ವ ಕರಣೀಯ ಕುರ್ಯಾದ್ಯೈವ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮನ್ ವೆರಿ ಈಸಿ ವರ್ಸ್ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ನ ಕಹಚಿತ್ ಅಪಿ ಲೆಟ್ ಮೀ ಬ್ರೇಕ್ ದ ಡೌನ್ ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕಹಚಿತ್ ಬಿಸ್ನೆಸ್ ನ ಕಹಚಿತ್ ಅಪಿ kashchit in samastha it goes kashchit okay it actually cannot be put as kahachit just for breaking up i showed kaha plus chit okay chit plus api chid api takara becomes dakara okay so kashchit api janati kim kasya shvaha this is utva visarga shvaha bhavishyati ataha shvaha karaniyani ಕುರ್ಯಾತ್ ಅದ್ಯ ಏವ ಟೂ ಸಂಧೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಒನ್ ವ್ಯಂಜನ ಸಂಧಿ ಒನ್ ಸ್ವರ ಸಂಧಿ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಐಲ್ ಬ್ರೇಕ್ ದಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಯುರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ನಾಟ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಡೂ ಇಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮ್ ಬಟ್ ವಿ ಕೀಪ್ ಲರ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಟೈಮ್ ಕುರ್ಯಾತ್ ಅದ್ಯ ಏವ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ನ ನಾಟ್ ವೆರಿ ಈಸಿ ನೋ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಹ ಹೂ ಕಹ ಚಿತ್ ಆರ್ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಎನಿ ಹೂ okay any one okay so kashchit is a pullinga variant of saying any any male okay not any person not any nara not any manushya not any one uh, pullinga is used by default it could mean any lady also but they definitely usually use pullinga reference in as the first reference na kashchit api also janati nos kim what kasya of whom shwaha tomorrow bhavishyati happens so no one knows what happens to whom tomorrow is the queen's english statement no one knows what will happen to whom tomorrow hmm? appease a little bit like padapurnaka we can take it as uh, to whom and to and what that sense also you can take that's what they have taken and to whom like that ಓಕೆ ಅತ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಶ್ವ ಕರಣೀಯ ಇನ್ ಬ್ರಾಕೆಟ್ ಕಾರ್ಯ ಶ್ವ ಕರಣೀಯ ಕಾರ್ಯ ವಾಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಕರಣೀಯ ಮೀನ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಕರಣೀಯ ದೋಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲೂರಲ್ ಸೊ ದೋಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಕೃದಾತುಸ್ ಡೆರಿವೇಟಿವ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಕರಣೀಯ ಕಾರ್ಯ ಅಬ್ವಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ಕೃದಾತು ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ದೇರ್ ಐ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ಲಿ ನೋ ದ ವರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ವರ್ಕ್ ಅಪಾನ್ that sense okay kuryat may one do may one do so kaha naraha naraha kuryat adya eva today only adya eva this is called vriddhi sandhi okay i kara has come from a plus a i so vriddhi sandhi adya eva adya eva so natural you see then kuryat plus adya because of the swara soft swara the takara has softened to a dakara ತ ತ ಧ ಸಾರಿ ತ ಥ ದ ಸೊ ಅಲ್ಪ ಪ್ರಾಣ ದಕಾರ ಇಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಚೇಂಜ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಅಲ್ಪ ಪ್ರಾಣ ತಕಾರ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಸ್ ಟು ದ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ ಕುರಿಯಾದ್ಯೈವ ಓಕೆ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನ್ ದ ಒನ್ ವಿತ್ ಎ ಗುಡ್ ನಾಲೆಡ್ಜ್ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ದ ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟ್ ಪರ
ಸೊ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನ್ ಅದ್ಯೇವ ಕುರಿಯಾತ್ ಶ್ವಃ ಕರಣೀಯಾನಿ ಕಾರ್ಯಾಣಿ ಅದ್ಯೇವ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನ್ ಕುರಿಯಾತ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಸೊ ಸೇ ವೆರಿ ನೈಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಚಿತ್ ಚನ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಚಿತ್ ಚನ ಪ್ರಯೋಗ ದಿಸ್ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಕಾಚಿತ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಕಶ್ಚನ ಕಾಚನ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಕಿಂಚನ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಓಕೆ ಕಹ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಟು ಕ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಕಾ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಟು ಕಾಚಿತ್ ಕಿಂ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಟು ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಆರ್ ಚನ ವೇರಿಯಂಟ್ಸ್ ಕಶ್ಚನ ಕಾಚನ ಕಿಂಚನ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಶೋ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಯು ದ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಪ್ರಥಮ ವಿಭಕ್ತಿ ಏಕವಚನ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಿಕ್ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಕಹ ಶಬ್ದ ವಿಲ್ ಡಿಕ್ಲೈನ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ವಿಭಕ್ತೀಸ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ತ್ರೀ ವಚನಸ್ ಸೊ ದರ್ ಇಲ್ ಬಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಚಿತ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಚನ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಚಿತ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಚನ ಬೋತ್ ಲೀಡ್ ಆಫ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಚಕಾರ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ವೇರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಕಾಂಪೌಂಡ್ ದ ಕಹ ವಿತ್ ಚಿತ್ ಆರ್ ಚನ ಬಟ್ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ವೇರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಒನ್ ಡಿಕ್ಲೆನ್ಷನ್ ಟು ಅನದರ್ ಕಹ ಕೌಕೆ ಸೊ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಕೌಚಿತ್ ಕೇಚಿತ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ಕಹ ದಟ್ ವಿಸರ್ಗ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಎ ಶಕಾರ ಕಶ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಎ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಗ್ಯಾನ್ ಡೋಂಟ್ ವರಿ ಟೂ ಮಚ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಇಟ್ ನಾವು ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಟು ನೋ ದಟ್ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಟೆಕ್ನಿಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಹ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಎವರ್ ಓಕೆ ಈ ಹಿಂದಿ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಹಮಾರ ಮದರ್ ಟಂಗ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಐಸಾ ಯೂಸ್ ಕರ್ತೆ ನಾ ಕೌನ್ ಕೌನ್ ಬಿ ಕೊಯಿ ಬಿ ಅಫ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ಸೇ ಕೌನ್ ಬಿ ಯು ಸೇ ಕೊಯಿ ಬಿ ಸಮ್ ವೇರಿಯಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಹಿಂದಿ ಸೇಮ್ ವೇ ಇನ್ ಇನ್ ದ್ರಾವಿಡ ಭಾಷಾ ಯಾರು ಯಾರೋ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅವರ್ ಓನ್ ಡ್ರ್ಯಾಗ್ ವೇ ಆಫ್ ಡಿರೈವಿಂಗ್ ದ ಚಿತ್ಚನ ಪ್ರಯೋಗ ಓಕೆ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಎ ಪ್ರಿಸೈಸ್ ಚಿತ್ಚನ ಪ್ರಯೋಗ ದೇ ಗಿವ್ ಟು ವೇರಿಯಂಟ್ಸ್ ಚಿತ್ತರ್ಚನ why they give to maybe kavis will enjoy that because they can do some pada variations when they do so versus they can use chit in some places chana in some places not that i see much difference but chit is having a halanta takara so it can compound into the next letter ras chana generates a full full nakara so there is no halanta there so it it gives an extra matra for them if they need okay <laughs> all right any question so that first line show uh, show ah. ah, very good so uh, i forgot to explain that this shwaha this visarga is a, is a, is a visarga sandhis are a class of their own in fact even if you go to panini and grammar or you know komudi etc and study we talk of swara sandhis in one breath we talk of we talk of vyanjana sandhi in another breath but we talk of visarga sandhi in a third breath we don't combine it with either swara sandhi or vyanjana sandhi because there are a class of its own it has its own complication okay there are six seven variations of uh, visarga sandhis that occur when one, the, what you are seeing is called utva visargasya utvam it is called shu plus u it will become instead of shu plus h okay or aha will become u you can say and then shwa probably shwa plus u i think yeah shwa plus u becomes shwo as a internal further guna okay so shwaha becoming shwo is called utva and it happens in the presence of soft vyanjanas like bhakara is a mrudu vyanjana okay there are rules uh you will study that uh, thankfully you won't be troubled with visarga sandhi till shiksha level because it's a little advanced and complex they teach you at the shiksha level but because we are going to see them every day i am talking about them so that you start we don't need to know all the technology what is happening at least we need to know the reverse oh sometimes shwa will come that means shwaha like that due to sandhi it is shwa okay mm. ಸೊ ಶ್ವ ಕಸ್ಯ ಕಂ ಭವಿಷ್ಯತಿ ಇದು ನ ಕಚಿದಿ ಜಾತಿ ಅಥ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮನ್ ನರ ಶ್ವಕರಣೀಯಾನಿ ಕಾರ್ಯಾಣಿ ಅಧ್ಯಯವ ಕುರಿಯಾತ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವಿ ಕಾಲ್ ಅನ್ವಯ ವಾಕ್ಯ ಸೊ ಅನ್ವಯ ವಾಕ್ಯ ವಿತ್ ದ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾಹರಣ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಲೆವೆಲ್ಸ್ ನೋ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ಟೀಚ್ ಯು ಎ ಲಾಟ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಹೌ ಟು ಡೂ ಆಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಯು ಟುಡೇ ಯು ಆರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಟೆಪಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡನ್ ಸಮ್ ಸ್ಟಡೀಸ್ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಹೈಸ್ಕೂಲ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಲೇಜಸ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡನ್ ದ ಶಿದಿನ ಶಿಬಿರ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರ
because for you to pick up the parts, I have to go a little deeper. But in the exam, you are not expected to do this Anvaya Vakya. You are not expected to understand there is a Chichana Prayoga, there is a Utva, Fevisarga, nothing. All just for extra gyan, I am saying. Okay? You just have to remember this Yamadharma Raja when you look at this Subhashita. That's all. <laughs> So obviously, what happens tomorrow is necessarily reminding us about our impermanence. That's why I put Yama's <laughs> photo there. Okay. Huh. Okay, let's, uh, we have 10 minutes to finish the, uh, before our break, 11 or 12 o'clock break, we have 10 minutes to do the Abhyasas, Patanta uh, Prashna. So this again is a little bit written uh, exercise, so not much that you can dynamically help with. Um, but somebody can read it for me, though, those who are confident they can read the English letters accurately in Sanskritam can read it for me. Let me call someone. Um, Tripti, Tripti Varye. Yes. Haan. Can you write down it is written, but can you read this Devanagari script slowly, accurately in Sanskritam pronunciation? Madhu, Madhu Karo, Namo Ekaha, hmm. Chalakaha, hmm. Nusangare. <laughs> I can understand your, uh, your horror at looking at that. Mysuru Nagare. <laughs> it's not, it's written together, so it's difficult to. No, no. Hmm. What you do, no, you take little pieces and construct the uh, the samyukta akshara first my su ru na ga re that is the technique okay, okay. so yeah yeah my sura nagare vasati sma sma correct so let me repeat that sentence so that others pick up the whole thing madukaro nama ekaha chalakaha my suru nagare vasati sma so madukaraha so remember here also O is due to Visarga. Madhukaraha Nama. So with the name Madhukara, Ekaha Chalakaha, one driver, Mysuru Nagare, in Mysuru Nagara, Vasati Sma, he used to live. Sma is like a used to sense. Once upon a time they used to, that sense. Okay. Vasati Sma, he used to. Uh, continue, Bhagini. Yeah. Tasya Trayaha Putraha. Asan. Okay. Now, Bhagini Asana. made three mistakes. Ah, you made three mistakes. Tasya, ah. Trayaha. No, Trayaha. See, there is only a trayaha. A without a bar. Trayaha. Putraha. Putraha. See, there is a Dirga. Putraha. Asan. Ah, okay. Yeah. So, A, A, A. Okay. Very important for Sanskritam. Okay. So, Tasya, Trayaha. Tra, sorry. Trayaha, Putraha, Asan. Of him. Tasya, of him or to him. Trayaha putraha, three sons, asan were there. So he had three children, male children. Ah, continue, Bhagini. Tasya grayam jayanagari. Griham. Griham. Jayanagari. So why is jayanagari? Jayanagari. Ah, no, Dirga. Jayanagari. Jayanagari. Okay. Asit. 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 Hmm. So Tasya Griham Jayanagare Asit. His house was in Jayanagar. Okay. Uh, uh, couple of more sentences. Hmm. Tasya Putraha hmm. Adya Adyayame Adyayane Adyayane. No Dirgas. Adyayane. Nipunaha. Hmm. Vinakara. Very well done. Nipunaha Asan. Asan. Well done. Bagin. So Tasya Putraha, no one second one, wait, wait, wait. Tasya Putraha, yeah. his sons, Adhyayane in studies, Nipunaha mm -hmm. Asan, they were smart, thankfully. Okay. Continue, Bhagini. Saha Sukhina. Sukhina na Sukhena. Sukhena. Jivanam. 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 See Hriswa. Jivanam. Jeevanam. Krutavan. Krutavan. So no drama in this paragraph. 
so he lived happily thankfully because his sons were smart unlike the three sons of uh, panchatantra <laughs> i forget their name also now vichitra buddhi something like some nice names are there anyway saha sukena jeevanam krutavan so he lived happily our our uh, chalaka no we are not going to get any panchatantra out of this story <laughs> anyway good abhyasa so i will i have written that in sanskrit for us so this here is our happy driver madukaro nama ekah chalakah mysuru nagare vasati sma tasya trayah putrah asan tasya griham jayanagare asit tasya putrah adhyayane nipunah asan sah sukena jeevanam krutavan so it is so important for all of us to learn one indian script which is complete Uh, um, because the pronunciation become accurate only when you look at one of our mother fonts so whether it's in kannada font or tamil extended tamil font or malayalam font they will support all these sounds accurately right and just like devanagiri of course does as the most uh, native font of sanskritam thanks bagini well done using mm-hmm. only uh, now we can crowd source this answers hopefully using only atmanepadi verbs translate the following trees grow people can shout out their answer if they can vrukshaha varanam hey what i didn't hear the kriya pada vrukshaha vardhante ha vardhante vardh datu is atmanepadi right so vardhante vrukshaha vardhante so what is atmanepadi declension vandate vandete vandante vandase vandethe vandadve vande vandavahe vandamahe of course sah vandate tau vandete te vandante tvam vandase yuvam vandethe yuyam vandadve aham vande avam vandavahe vayam vandamahe every opportunity to read these things once to memorize is a good opportunity okay so vrukshah vardhante the trees grow hmm. girls grieve kalikah pala kinnate kinnante 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 kinna kinnante kid actually it is kidyante okay kidyante kid dato okay kinnata comes as a derivative from kin kid dato original dato has a dakara so kidyante kidyate kidhyete kidya mahapranakara okay so i will open i have used vyathante but i think kidyante is also an answer i don't know what is there in textbook kidyante 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 you all protect uyam rakshadve uyam trayadve 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 acha uyam trayadve okay rakshate is not raksha raksha we have to see whether it is ubayapadi i'll cross check definitely i have heard rakshati whether rakshate rakshyate in nich uh, no, prayoga i have heard okay whether it is in atmanepadi atmanepadi whether it is a legal declension you have to check that's okay, okay. you you were constructed it accurately but then you have to uh, whether, whether you are allowed or not i have to check that's all okay, okay. so tra tra datu is definitely trayate trayate trayante so trayadve people have already answered street lights glow marga deepa deepaha 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 hmm deepaha prakashante prakashante kashante prakashante very good okay shobhante is also okay okay patha deepaha instead of marga i use patha marga is also very common marga deepaha shobhante well done okay we beg you yuyam vayam vayam याचामहे 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 वयम वेल सेड वी बेग वी बेग गॉड फॉर ग्रेस ओके वी ऑल बेग बट इन डिफरेंट वेस यू रन अवे तम 
धावते 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 ओके यू कैन टेक इन प्लूरल और सिंगुलर बोथ आर ओके लुक्स लाइक धाव धातु डस परमिट आई हैव टू चेक द टेक्स्ट बुक हियर ओके एनीवे यू गाइस क्रॉस चेक वेदर आई एम डूइंग द राइट थिंग हियर समटाइम्स आई बिकम ओवर कॉन्फिडेंट एंड डू द रॉन्ग थिंग let me go to the fourth lesson and patasya ante uh, we have apartan uh, ko oh third lesson sorry not fourth lesson third lesson to the end ha huh, palayase is there so i am not sure about dhavadve tvam palayase sounds uh, accurate one याचामहे हैव यूज द सेम धातु प्रकाशंते हैव यूज शोभंते वी विल चेक त्रायद्वे त्रायद्वे किद्यंते इज देयर इन द बुक आई हैव यूज व्यथंते आई हैव टू क्रॉस चेक द आत्मने पदित्वा वर्धंते वी आर कॉमन सो आई होप आई हैव क्रॉस चेक बट इट्स समथिंग दैट आई हैव टू आई हैव यूज्ड समथिंग डिफरेंट देन द बुक ओके आई हैव टू क्रॉस चेक वेदर आई एम लीगल सो ओके अम i know that we will not be so learned by the time we reach the exam that we will know just go with it at least put the form confidently if if you don't put that uh, put it in atmane padi and move forward don't get caught up in it okay hmm. because in arsha prayoga every dhatu was ubaya padi <laughs> so you can say you are doing arsha prayoga arsha prayoga is rishi rishi prayoga <laughs> okay all right so so few more questions answer the following questions what is ubaya padi so let me invite some one person uh, naresh kumar yes yeah. ha huh. try to answer this sir what is ubaya padi english only you can answer oh oh i think naresh kumar didn't unmute sandhya Varya, you are unmuted. You have to try. Yes, uh, sir. It's a verb which is conjugated in both uh, Parasmai Padi and Atmani Padi. Very good. You use the word conjugated, which is very accurate. Your English answer is hundred percent correct. So, a verb that can be conjugated in both Atmani Padi and Parasmai Padi forms is called Ubaya Padi, Dhatu or Dhatu. You can say verb stem, verb root, or Dhatu like that. Okay. All right. So. Okay. What is the thanks, Bagini? You can. Sir, one so, question here. Ha, Milind Varya. Sir, we can also say that uh, the verb which uh, where the uh, uh, third, uh, pratham shah ek vachana ends in te and ti. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You can say that way also. Basically, what you are doing is you are digging down, digging down to explain what is atmane padi, what is parasmay padi as part of the answer. That is good. Nothing wrong. Okay. 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 Ha. So Thank you you what you do when you answer that way you put the ver, ver, verb declines in prathama purusha ekavachana with the ending te and in bracket you put atmane padi then you go to uh, ti and put uh, parasmai padi and so that both answers come in the sentence okay okay thanks so i have just put it in sanskrit also just for a learning as a practice everything we will write in sanskrit dhatu hu yah atmane padi api cha parasmai padi rupan prapnoti tasya ubaya padi iti suchana bhavati dhatu hu tasya dhato ho iti shashtyam astu hmm oh, sorry what is the meaning of padona milindvarya your you can try this what is the meaning of padona padona is uh, quarter to hmm so you give uh -huh. little more okay usually two or three marks will be there so say uh -huh. something more now you give an example and explain okay ha uh, quarter to so if i write 945 uh -huh. i will say uh, padona dashavadanam very good so that much if you put but put the sanskrit words in devanagari lipi there okay don't struggle with english letters for sanskrit words put them in devanagari lipi just like my my blue answer see atmane padi parasmai padi ubaya padi i put it in sanskritam no need to torture ourselves in english okay state english words in english sanskrit words in sanskrit that is the best way to write 
okay when okay. when you can, when allowed partially english to answer so when the question is already uh, in english your answer will be in english okay no need to say that again thanks varia so when the time is quarter short of a full hour mark padano is prefixed for example see this is what i was telling mohodaya so put an example for example 8:45 is indicated as quarter less than 9 or padona navavadana he used a different time that's fine okay uh let's invite sandhya variye sandhya variye next question is yours ah uh, sir ha uh, what is the original what form of a verb called original form of verb uh, original form of a verb is called uh, dhatu verb very good Hmm. and in sanskritam dhatuhu you have to write okay and Sorry. and uh, just to extend the question what is the original form of a noun called um see the noun uh, generically is called a pada okay nama pada but the pratipadika okay. is called sorry Okay. I gave away the hands. <laughs> Pratipadika was recollecting. So, See, uh, habit, habit, habit. Pratipadika is called Pratipadika. What is there to say? Okay, sorry about that. Noun so, root is Pratipadika. Ah, uh, mm. noun root. You can call it root, or you can call it nouns uh, stem. Okay, noun stem yeah. we call it. Okay, for noun we say stem. For verb we say root. Okay. Ah, uh, so Sri Pai Varia. Sri Pai Varia. Yeah, can you give me? Yes, I'm. Which there. word in Sanskrit means quarter past? Sapada. Ah, uh, so you just in in exam you write fully. Sapada uh, is the word in Sanskrit. Sapada. Ah, uh, dwadasha vadanam bhavishyati. Ah, uh, you can put an example also. Okay, so in your ex in your answer you just don't say sapada and stop. Okay, sure. sapada okay. in Sanskrit letters. is the word in sanskrit that means quarter past full stop for example like mohodaya said you say all that okay yes, that will yes. be the good way to answer give one example okay, okay. thank you thank you so same way for original form of the word is called dhatu it will be nice to give some example for for example for the verb gachati gam is the dha, original form of the dhatu something whatever you remember you you show there okay hmm. thank you so much dhanyawad hmm i have just uh, given shorter answers due to lack of space here second sentence explaining with an example is always a good habit okay so with that we concluded the third chapter so we will take a water break now it's 1208 so 1211 1211 uh, sorry 1211 not 1211 1211 we will gather back for uh, starting the fourth lesson we are la not having you know we don't have the luxury of skipping time so please take a water break now
अस्तु स्वागतम पुनः तो अस्मा भी इदानीम चतुर्थ पाठे प्रवेश हक क्रियते अद्भुतम पाठ त्रयम अबवत चतुर्थ पाठे प्रवेश हक चतुर्थ पाठे वयम प्रविष्टा हा we became the fellows who entered fourth lesson sanskrit is beautiful how quickly you can construct the <laughs> voices and forms of sentence is amazing anyway <coughs> okay vishnu priya var ye you still have your hand up i guess you just forgot to lower it okay uh, i lower it no problem no problem lata var ye you have a question no i just mute everyone Okay. Sorry, I ended up muting you in the middle. Vishnu Priyavari again lifted her hand up. What was the question, Lata Bagini? You have to unmute yourself again. You are asking me, you said. Somebody asked a question. No, I have not raised. I am Lata, but then I have not raised. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Don't worry now. If the somebody has a question, they will ask again. See, I can mute you guys. I can't unmute you. Uh, I have to. Uh, tell you that because of privacy i can't unmute you but i can mute you okay so let us see what is the opening sukti for us in the fourth lesson praveshah chaturtah paatah udyoginam purusha simham upaiti lakshmihi udyoginam purusha simham upaiti lakshmihi okay udyoginam one who is fruitfully engaged in action udyoga means to be engaged in action so udyogina udyogin is the word i think nakaranta pratipadika so in in uh, karma position udyoginam it becomes okay tritiya vibhakti ekavachan so udyoginam to the one who is fruitfully engaged in action purusha simham see Purusha Simham is a Kavitva way of saying a brave person. Okay, the quality of Simha has been attached to the Purusha by saying Purusha Simha. So we use many other such uh, valorful brigas. So Purusha Simham, Purusha Vyagram. Uh, there are few other uh, variants we use. All that means that valor, valorous quality. of those animals are present in this purusha so purusha simha doesn't mean narasimha okay narasimha is of course the avatara is actually half man half lion this one is quality of the simha brought into the purusha purusha simham so again karma because udyoginam purusha simham upaiti lakshmihi upa upasarga plus eti okay eti means comes near okay upayeti means more accentuated form of coming near eti is more like moves goes so upayeti upaiti vruddhi sandhi there okay it is approaches okay lakshmihi see this one guys lakshmihi prathama ekavachana form of lakshmi is lakshmihi in sanskritam okay of course in our indian languages we use lakshmi e karanta but in sanskrita it is Lakshmi is the pratama ekavachana form. Okay. Of course, it is ikaranta Lakshmi shabda, but it starts with Lakshmi. It's very specific, unique uh, declension of its own. Okay. Um, so what is this? Very straightforward, right? So if you can read Lakshmi as actually the wealth that she grants, then prosperity is how we read shri or lakshmi we read as prosperity so prosperity comes to the brave person who is engaged in action not somebody who just has knowledge and sits tight okay prosperity draws near a man who is perseverant beautiful word used from english perseverant udyoga means to be engaged repeatedly and continuously perseverant and brave like a lion that is the simham has been taken to that So, what is the full beautiful verse? Let us read that. Always for us, it's interesting. Udyoginam purusha simham upaiti lakshmi hi daiva na de yamiti ka purusha havadanti daivam nihatya kuru paurusha matma shaktiya yatne krite yadi na siddhyati ko atra dosha ha ko atra dosha ha. Beautiful verse, ah? Huh? So, Kavi goes on and gives more insight in the remaining padas. so with this we saw 
for the once it is leading off with the bodha <laughs> and then now it goes a little more with examples okay daivena deyam iti kapurushaha vadanti kapurushaha means the inferior uh, men or more like cowards okay cowards tell that god should grant it is the cowards who tell that god alone should grant and they themselves don't put any effort okay that's what he says the contrast of the purusha simha is the ka purusha okay they they want without uh, with a divine they want divine grace and fruit without effort daivam nihatya kuru paurusham atma shaktya okay so here what they are uh, saying is tvam you okay tvam daivam nikuru is in madhyama purusha that's why tvam is implicit there tvam you daivam nihatya okay so that nihatya is in the sense of uh, without considering okay without considering the divine grace daivam is in the sense of divine grace so without anticipating divine grace paurusham atma shaktya kuru paurusham here refers to the purusha effort okay so paurusham is not that <coughs> paurusham this is pau, uh, effort, manly effort okay paurusham manly effort atma shaktya with your own self effort self strength you do okay that's what kavi is saying here very straight forward yatne krute yadi karyam in bracket na siddhyati kah atra doshah yatne krute sati this is called sati saptami prayoga saptami is used as a conditional uh, prefix okay yatne krute sati same thing we use in english you see upon upon is a saptami prayoga no adhikarana prayoga so even upon trying even upon trying despite trying even upon trying i'm using the saptami variant yatne krute sati api satyapi i am adding myself okay yadi in if na siddhyati karyam na siddhyati we have to take the work that we do the phalam na siddhyati the fruit doesn't get obtained doesn't get ready kah atra doshah at least the effort we did so there is no dosha we don't have to be regretting because we have to only regret if we didn't work towards it okay ko atra doshah this what says okay उद्योगिनम पुरुष सिंह मुपैति लक्ष्मी हि दैवे न दे यमिति का पुरुषा ह वदन्ति दैवम निहत्य कुरुपाऊरुषमात्मशक्तिया यत्ने कृते यदि न सिद्ध्यति कोत्र दोषा ह के ब्यूटीफुल एनी क्वेश्चन so another word for paurusham is the manusham manusha prayatna we say na manusham paurusham so it's not in the sense of any ahankara sense it is in the more human effort basic sense daivam what is that of god, from god so divine grace something like that upa eti upaiti upasarga upa upasarga is there then eti is the dhatu i mean kriyapada Mm. so pur purusha simha you can break it down as purusha yah simhavat dhairya yukta sah purusha simha it is a type of samasa so but i have given something more than a normal vigraha vakya so purusha yah the man who is simhavat dhairya yukta so one who is containing the valor of the sim, simha type simha nature okay bhashabhyasa okay so now we move to past tense today so now please, what they are can yes, i were, ask yes mahodaya please please uh, please go to the previous uh, slide uh, in that uh, just wanted to know whether when you said the purushah yah simvavat dhairya yuktah sah purusha simha that can mm, be added sah sah has to be added i i went short just, just wanted to ask you thank you so no, much no 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 you are right sah should complete it there if i am writing vigraha vakya there is no need to eat up anything <laughs> when it comes yaha saha should come that correct right. correct but sa is almost implicit so it can be avoided but that okay. will become prouda at this level i have to put it okay, okay. thank you thank you well done question 
ओके सो भाषाभ्यास सो नौ अर्लियर दे यूज टू गो लिटल मोर् स्लोली सो नौ दे आर् मूविंग इन टू प्रथम पुरुष एकवचन बहुवचन मध्यम पुरुष उत्तम पुरुष आल इन वन गो गायस् ओके दे विल गिव सम एक्सापल एंड कीप मूविंग दे आर ट्रई टू एक्सिलेट सो दट दे कैन स्टार्ट टीचिंग अदर ग्रामर आस्पेक्ट सून ओके Uh, so so far we are learning uh, focusing on kriya pada a little bit if you see of course we are learning uh, how to use a simple noun in prathama purusha how to use tvam yuvam yuyam in madhyama purusha aham avam vayam in uttama purusha but we are focusing on the kriya pada so far okay how they decline for some simple uh, kala so today's kala is called bhuta kala which is actually lang bhuta kala there are <laughs> sanskritam is quite tough on you guys there are three bhutakalas okay guys there are three bhutakalas okay lang is one of the bhutakalas okay so there is something called paroksha aparoksha and samanya bhutakala so i won't go into what the qualities of each is but just understand that this is one of them okay bhutakala past tense prathama purusha ekavachanam okay so third person singular always we start with our uh, that one no 1.1 we call it 1.1 1.2 we don't practice so much then 1.3 bahuvachana we practice next so let me pick a volunteer monika varie yes ma'am sir ha mahode please uh, starting from this bhasha abhyasa read up to the 10th sentence slowly Uh, read the Sanskrit one clearly, and then the English. If there is any pronunciation correction, I will step in. Yeah. Okay. Bhasha bhyasa ha, put kala ha, past tense. Pratham purusha ha, eka vachanam, third person singular. Saha akridat. He played. Ha. See, Bagini Asia... pronounced it very accurately. See, she put a little bit stress on the a. Uh, instead of hurrying to akridat like that i like the way she said akridat okay though there is a little kakara twice coming in her pronunciation it is helpful at this stage because the a is accented a little bit the way she pronounced nothing wrong the actual precise pronunciation is akridat there is no need to do akridat uh, accent the akara so much but it is good at this time to when we are still learning thanks bagini continue eshah this no don't stop too much you are stopping too much okay <laughs> this person stood uh. chaturaha patham apathat the clever one read the lesson read read the lesson of course read english is a dumb uh, script so you cannot you have to use the same same letters and sometimes say read sometimes say read god bless yeah, us right. <laughs> okay charmkaraha padaraksham ayachat Well done. The cobbler gave the sandal. Ah, uh, so yach the yach dato is ya yach dato I think. So that one is to give, right? So ayachat means he gave past tense, okay? And padaraksham, okay, strilinga. So padaraksha iti strilinge. So padaraksham iti sitaam iti eta tata, okay? Charma karha is the cobbler, one who works with with the skin. Okay, continue, Mukti. Singa. Mrigam Amaryat, the lion killed the deer. Ha, huh. can you pronounce the sentence again? Sing ha ha. Ha, so now what is happening? Bagini is used to using a little gakara there for hakara. I would say that's okay. It's a local variation. Sing ha, they will say, but it's sim ha in Sanskrit. Okay, gakara okay. ga ga. Either soft ga or mahaprana ga is not needed. Sim ha ha. Can you try? Sim ha ha. Ah, well done. Yeah. Brigham Amaryat. Hmm. Vyagraha ma mamsam khadat. Ah. Uh, Akhadat. Akhadat. Well done. Vyagraha mamsam khadat. The tiger ate flesh. Hmm. Marjaraha mushikam apashyat. Hmm. The cat saw rat. Ha. Vyasya ha patram alikat. No, no. Friend again, or... again, again. Repeat. Uh, Vyasya. No, no. Where there is Vyasya, there. Can you read again? Vyasya. Ah, very, very different. Okay. Vyasya. Yeah, right. Full vakara. Okay. Vyasya. Yeah. Hmm. Vyasya. 
patram alikhat friend wrote a letter uh, yeah actually this one is a very very interesting uh, use of the word friend vs yeah i also did not know till today i have read it so many times and it is not recorded in my head i thought okay we know vs kaha right vs kaha means one who is old so there is actually a word for friend in, in that sense vs yah very interesting vs yah vs yah patram alikat friend wrote a letter okay nice let us remember this vs yah okay continue bagini panditah satyam avadat the scholar told the truth hmm alsah tam uh, uh, anindat uh, uh, again again alasah hmm. tam anindat hmm. the lazy person rebuked him Uh, ninda is to rebuke or uh, blame na so anindat he blamed or rebuked tam some some fellow okay tam would be some lady as a target tam is a fellow as a target tam purusham anindat alasaha one who is lazy alasya asti asti sah alasaha hmm. well done bagini uh, only here and there i think a little bit of that auto halant uh, which which of course i i i completely understand it's it's a challenge for hindi speaking people to read the same script they have read it in one way to read it differently for sanskritam but uh, just always remember sanskritam uses it in a puritan pronunciation hindi does some automatic things that are not seen in print okay, uh, okay. remember who is deviating that's all <laughs> <laughs> thanks bagini well done thank you so ha huh. so jyoti prakash variye jyoti variye oh sorry sorry i i you mute yourself mute yourself don't worry don't worry sorry sir ha smita krishnan yes you go paktah devam avadan avadanta Uh, uh, read again. Aktaha devam avadanta. Where is avadanta there? The avandata. Ah, very very accurate. You have to put the nakara first, right? So avandata, avandata, vandate, vandete, vandante. So for for still now, see creed datu is creedati. It's a parasmai padi datu. So creedati goes to a creedat, tishtati goes to a tishtat. पठति गोस्टु अपठत यच्छति गोस्टु अयच्छत मारयति गोस्टु अमारयत खादति गोस्टु अखादत एक्सेट्रा 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 नाउ दे आर स्विचिंग टू स्टिल वी आर इन द प्रथम पुरुष एकवचन ओनली सो व्हाट चेंज्ड व्हाई डिड आई पुट ए ब्लू लाइन फ्रॉम 11 ऑनवर्ड्स बिकॉज़ दीस धातुस आर आत्मनेपदी धातुस ओके सो इंस्टेड ऑफ अवंदत इट हैज अवंदत साउंड अवंदते vandate of pras of uh, atmanepadi datu in lat or pratamana kala becomes avandata full akara is heard there okay no halantya like here okay avandata ha ah. so the devotee worshiped god continue bagini a devotee worshiped god nirdhanaha kashtam asahata a poor person bore with the difficulty Uh, bore means to bore whatever difficulty with it is called bearing right so bore with difficulty asahata okay sahana rakshitavan nirdanah continue sajjanah jana janan asevat asevata asevata a good person serve the people hmm janan karma pada bahuvachana okay जनान असेवत सेवते सी ऑल ऑफ द वंदते सहते सेवते ऑल ऑफ देम हैव गॉट टू अवंदत असहत असेवत लाइक दैट ओके कंटिन्यू अध्यापकः छात्रम अश्लाघत अ टीचर प्रेज्ड द स्टूडेंट हम्म अश्ला श्लाघते अश्लाघत ओके अध्यापक छात्र श्लाघते ही अप्रिशिएट्स अश्लाघत ही डिड अप्रिशिएट इन द पास्ट सो अप्रिशिएटेड प्रेज्ड लास्ट शुकह धनिकम अयाचत अ बेगर बेग्ड अ रिच मैन करेक्ट बेगर बेग्ड अ रिच मैन बेग्ड 
to a rich man or some i don't know how to say this accurately in english he begged yeah i think there is no two required a rich man you have to put it in the correct position yeah so let us see a few more sentences of this no okay so that the, they gave whereas they gave 10 examples of uh, uh, parasmai padi they gave only five examples of atmane padi it is not totally imbalanced because actually there tends to be more parasmai padi dhatus than atmane padi dhatus okay tend to be a smaller set that's why they have gone that way okay at this level they don't want to hammer you with very complicated atmane padi dhatus so they have stuck to a few examples okay thanks bagini well done uh, let's invite a gentleman huh. um naresh kumar uh, sharma uh, i think i had called you some time back maybe you were not able to participate are you able to participate now sir naresh kumar sharma if you can try to unmute yourself unfortunately i can't unmute you okay uh, i think for some reason he is not able to participate we'll skip forward to milind varya milind badkundri varya please kindly unmute yourself and read us through these uh, 15 sentences slowly yes sir te ahasan e te they laughed hmm. how they yeah 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 just uh, just a pause yeah so oh. now ahasat um uh, see saha ahasat we had seen right for uh, for um, hasati had gone to ahasat in ekavachana hasanti goes to ahasan okay ahasan hasanti goes to ahasan like that plural okay sahatoute ahasan they laughed continue sir ete akridan de played mm. and they played this this actually ate these yeah these. these these fellas they played, played. okay chora ha petikam aharan thieves stole the box now they have thrown a karma pada okay petikam aharan okay so chora ha petikam uh, haranti in lat okay aharan in lang अध्ययन 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 डिवोटीज मेडिटेटेड ऑन गॉड हां ध्यायति ध्यायन्ति प्लूरल इन लैट आर वर्तमान अध्ययन इन प्लूरल इन पास्ट टेंस भक्ताः देवम अध्ययन भक्ताः देवम अध्ययन नेक्स्ट वन इज खला खलाह सुराम महिला महिला श्लोक अगायन वुमन सैंग द वर्स श्लोक सो वन श्लोक दे दे सैंग अगायन सो गायंति महिला श्लोक गायंति अगायन शिफ्ट्स द होल थिंग टू पास्ट टेंस ओके नथिंग चेंजेस इन द नाउन स्टैक ओनली द वर्ब शिफ्ट्स द टाइम सर्पाह मंडुका मंडुकान Uh, gilan serpent swallowed frogs <laughs> so uh, see gilati gilati very useful dhatu okay i think this is uh, gale me dalna that gala 
gala comes throat na so gila is the dhatu from which uh, uh, from which the gala also comes and and so gilati means swallows puts it into the throat like that okay a gilan they swallowed in lung well done thank continue varya uh, krupanaha phalam ajighran uh, phalam you have to read huh? phalam phalam mm -hmm. krupanaha phalam ajighran misers smelt the fruit <laughs> okay i don't know what is the intent of this sentence <laughs> they don't they want to buy it they just smelt it sir ah, they, they didn't want it. to buy it theek hai de dete hain un logon ko theek hai thank you varya well done well done. one question here ha ah. ah, whenever uh, we uh, have a opposite word no we uh, normally put a in front of it करेक्ट सो ओवर टाइम ओवर टाइम यू विल पिक अप दिस डिफरेंस हाउ टू टेक द डिफरेंस फ्रॉम लंग एंड नेगेशन ओके एंड यूजली फॉर फॉर वर्ब्स वी कीप ए न अवे एंड से न करो थी लाइक दट ओके because initially so, i had a problem a uh, a uh, credit i i used to say that they didn't play <laughs> <laughs> you have to now know there is lung which has the prefix a uh, also adding see this this when the verb declines in the lung not only the tail varies the head also has the akara okay uh -huh. so there is a double modification we have to be aware of and over time you will learn nagachati uh, na is the largely the one that comes uh, and n plus agachati nagachati like that it will come okay so oh. usually when we add n to verbs it remains like a nakara mm. okay uh. it's like uh, that adi anadi when you say no sir uh, uh, that is a noun no, that is a that, noun yeah uh, no you put that's why it becomes ha uh. it is not क्रियापदे well read thank you so we will invite one more person to conclude with uh, today's uh, because time is also running past um who sandhya has lifted her hand okay she gets a go so yes, you have sir. five sentences bagini yeah okay durjanaha sajjanan abha abadhanta ah uh. Wicked people, troubled, troubled good people. Good people. So here, see, bhadate, bhadete, bhadante. What is happening in these five sentences? Is these five sentences are atmane padi dhatus. Okay. And so we are going prathama purusha bahuvachana for them. So here, let us look at the table a little bit before we go on. So vardhate dhatu, if you take, which is an atan atmane padi dhatu, avardhata, avardetham, avardhanta. संस्कृत भारती टीच एस एन आलटर्नेटिव टू इंस्टेड ऑफ यूजिंग लंग लकारा दे टीच ए वे ऑफ यूजिंग better to learn this it's uh, it's a important uh, lakara lang lakara so better to learn the atmane padi declensions also okay i'll just go to the previous slide just to read the pat dhatus which is parasmai padi variants apathat apathatam apathan apathaha apathatam apathata apatham apathava apathama but remember so far we, the two red to read once only we have practiced in sentences okay prathama purusha ekavachana and bahuvachana only we have practiced we haven't tried dvivachana nor yet we have moved into madhyama purusha and uttama purusha rows yet okay but to learn to memorize these tables are useful 
अपठत अपठथाम अपठन अपठ अपठतम अपठत अपठम अपठाव अपठाम इनिशियली इट्स इंपार्टेंट टू कीप दिस एज मेमोराइज टेबल्स ओवर टाइम इट बिकम्स अ हैबिट थम अपट बिकम्स अ हैबिट थम अगच्छ बिकम्स अ हैबिट ओके लाइक दट ओके सेम वे फॉर आत्मने पदी वी गो अवर्धत अवर्धे अवर्धेताम अवर्धंत अवर्धता अवर्धेताम अवर्धध्व अवर्धे अवर्धावि अवर्धाम ऑफकोर्स फॉर द टेबल हैव इंक्लूडेड द सब्जेक्ट नाउन आलो कैन बी प्रैक्टिस अलांग विद दैट बट मेंटली इट शुड बी देर थम यु आम यू एम शुड रन यून इन युअर ब्रेन वेन वि गो टू मध्यम पुषा अहम आवाम वयम शुड रन इन युअर ब्रेन वेन यू गो टू उत्तम पुषा एंड सह तौते आर साते तानी वाट एवर यू चूज यूशली वि गो विथ सह तौते ओके आर राम 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 आलो इज ओके सो भगिनी यू कैन कंटिन्ू सारी फॉर द पास हाँ असहंता पीपल बोर द डिफिकल्टी गृहिण्यः बालकान अत्रायंता हाउस वाइफ्स सेव्ड द बॉयज सेव्ड इज अ लिटिल स्ट्रेच प्रोटेक्टेड इज द करेक्ट वर्ड त्रा त्रा इज टू प्रोटेक्ट ओके सो द द हाउस वाइफ्स प्रोटेक्टेड द बॉयज फ्रॉम व्हाटएवर डिफिकल्टी दैट दे एनकाउंटर्ड कंटिन्यू अगेन ट्रांसलेशन बट begging involves arms so it's also just added there for effect it's not needed beggars begged the rich uh, here if you don't put farm you don't know who is begging whom so they just decided to extend it a little bit okay well done bagini so with that we will call it a day so tomorrow 11 o'clock we start with the madhyama purusha and uttama purusha practices and keep going okay thank you very much good thing we started with the fourth lesson today so have a nice uh, rest of the day we'll gather back tomorrow prarthanaya samaptim ghoshayami prashnah santi chet prichantu santi va rama bagini prashnah asti va na astu maya tarhi samapti ghoshanam kriyate sahana vavatu sahanau bunaktu saha viryam karava vahai tejasvina vadhitam astu ma vidvisha vahai e om shanti 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 हरि ओम धन्यवाद शुभ दिन धन्यवाद महोदय नमस्ते वर्य नमस्ते वर्य